Well, have you ever experienced an unbearable itch that wouldn't go away? Researchers in St. Louis are getting closer to finding out why. Seth Lemon has the story. At 81 years old, Don Hodges has battled enemies at war and about with cancer. But seven years ago, he started combating an itch all over his body. I went through so many dermatologists that uh, uh, we knew each other by first names and family members and everything, and uh, they just give up. Creams, ointments, and medication didn't help. Don's among 15% of people who suffer from unexplained chronic itch. Study after study has shown that it's worse than chronic pain, um, or comparable, my patients tell me it's often worse. Dr. Brian Kim is a researcher at the world's first center for the study of itch at Washington University School of Medicine in St. Louis, Missouri. After discovering an itch molecule, scientists expanded their work from testing treatments on itchy lab mice to finding relief for desperate patients. A lot of people didn't believe that it, not only was it not a real problem, that it was a problem that we really could solve at the scientific level. Doctors finally found a way to help Don. After several failed treatments, an arthritis drug is giving him relief. Within a week, no, uh, I, it probably from the day I took it, and uh, it went away and hasn't come back. You don't get to be 81 years old for giving up. And Dr. Kim isn't giving up either. It doesn't have to stop here. That's just one drug, one pathway, but we think there's a lot more. Clearing a path to help many more scratch an unbearable itch. Seth Lemon, CBS News, St. Louis, Missouri.